Finals. Game one of the Western Conference Finals begins in a moment. This is Kevin Harlan joined by Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and on the sideline, David Aldridge. And the news here, Nurkic here won't go. play. The injury keeping him out. Kevin, well, when you consider this injury that he has, I mean, it's pretty clear he's going to miss the rest of the playoff. Let's take a look at our starters for Portland. The high-powered backcourt pair, Lillard and McCollum. Andre Hollis Jefferson out there with Norman Powell, and it's Cantor in at the five spot. And Woody with the bucket. And look at how quick he was to bite on the pump fake. Left his feet way too soon. Miller against Ilyasova. Pass to McCollum. Nice pass. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Yeah, you know, often we think of Dame as a score first, but they're reminding us of his great ability to pass the rock. How about the head of steam he's able to generate right there and just gets to the rack really easy. Montreal shooting their first free throw attempt on the night. Free throw no good from Dinwiddie. McCollum left side. No good on the three. And so Green will bring it up for Montreal. Dinwiddie passes to Poole. Shoots the three. Cranes the three-pointer. Dinwiddie's got his third bucket of the night. And that's exactly what he's looking for. Draining the triple. Pass to Cannon. Here's Lillard. And again, it's Portland converting. The natural offensive talent of Lillard gives him incredible flexibility. And boy, he can strike at any time. Lopez finds Green. And another three for Montreal. And early on, they look great. They've made all four of their shots to start this game. And in the first, a little over a minute and a half in. Lillard way outside. Trailblazers keep it alive. And it's sent back by Lopez. It's a bonus whenever Lopez comes up with the swat. You want to see more of this from the big fella. And whatever coach told them coming out of the locker room, they're listening. Five out of five already. Here's Lillard after the basket by Montreal. Over to the wing. Hollis Jefferson passes the cannon. Kicks to Powell. Launches a three. Gets the three-pointer to fall. This is why you're trying to get him as many touches as possible. He's got the deck. Here's Dinwiddie. It's deflected. There's Hollis Jefferson. Sinks that one from the post. Man, I'll tell you, when you get your floater game going, it's a tremendous weapon. Dinwiddie outside. This one for three. And another three for Montreal. Yeah, those are starting to add up, guys. Of their last five baskets, three have been tripled. So timeout called here. The first for Portland. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Here's Simons. He's covered by Rondo. A nice shot by Simons. Just setting the tone with an aggressive move to the rack. And, and where's the help defensively? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. Little can't hit. And so it's Rondo bringing it up for Montreal. Jackson passes to Brissett. The rim-rattling two-handed jam. Sky high, one of his advantages as an undersized four. Here's McCollum. They can go two for one. It's about being smart right now. Here's Giles. He's covered by Rondo. Gets it to go. That one good from Giles. Poor interior defense. If you play him soft, he's going to kill you. Two points. That one goes. Obviously, Rondo's main priority is to dish the rock. When you're open, he'll get it to you. Trailblazers trail by four. There's a four-second difference from the shot clock to the game clock. McCollum with the ball. He's picked up by Rondo. McCollum, no good. 
And now the fast break, Rondo with the ball. Here's Brissett. Off target with his three. And it's the Trailblazers on the break. Here's McCollum. Oh, and that one had the right spit on it, and it is good. What a professional. McCollum's reliability on offense is such a gift to his team. And we've got more NBA action on 2K Sports coming. And we're ready to get back into the action here in game one. Let's see what this quarter has in store for us. And from what you've seen from Montreal, uh, guys, what do you think? Boy, th their offense looks really good when everyone's in sync. Terrific first quarter. This is exactly what you want to see if you're a coach. Your team starting fast and playing with confidence. And now let's check out the lineups courtesy of Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go. Here's the second quarter to play. On the court right now for the Trailblazers. At the two and the three, McCollum and Little. Collins is out there with Giles, and it's Simons in at the one. Here's McCollum after Montreal picked up three with their last shot. That's the kind of take charge attitude they want CJ to have. Attack the D at every opportunity. And he's got his first free throw of the game, and he knocks down the first one. And so McCollum nails both of them. Montreal leading by three. Smith the pass to Brooks. Some nice passing by Montreal here. Jackson from long range. Sinks the three-pointer. Jackson's got six. Yeah, that's two bombs in a row from long range. There's the feed to Little. It's good. He scores. That's his first basket after missing his first two attempts. Now one for three. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Now, here is Smith. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. And Smith isn't afraid of getting hit on the way up, constantly getting into the guts of the D and, and forcing the issue. Montreal is shooting their second and third shots at the line right here. So, for Montreal, Ilya Sova, he's checked in for Lopez. Green comes in for Dylan Brooks. And Dinwiddie subbed in for Frank Jackson. An almost entirely new group here for Portland. Ennis Canner's checked in for Giles. Andre Hollis Jefferson comes in for Zach Collins. Powell, he's checked in for Little. And Lillard subbed in for C.J. McCollum. Passes it to Brissette. Here's Dinwiddie. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. Dinwiddie's got the lead up to six now for Montreal. I like what he's doing here. Terrific efficiency scoring the basketball. Lillard looking around. To the middle. Laid in with a nice touch off the glass. Six points for Ennis Kanter. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. Smith, no luck. Trailblazers trail by four. Lillard with it. Now Smith defending. And Lillard gets it to go. And when Lillard's hitting the tray ball, it really opens things up for him. As good a passer as he is, he becomes a major headache for the D if he gets hot from beyond. Rajon Rondo's checked in for Dennis Smith. 143 left here in the second. Dinwiddie up top. He's got 15, and Damian Lillard pulls it down. They're running. Powell, no one around him, and the Trailblazers, another three. That's a smart move to pull up for a three on the break. Defense is usually packed the pink and forget to guard the outside jump shot. Here's Rondo. And Ilyasova kicks to Green. Knocks down the three ball. Green's got six points. The defense is far too slow to close out on those three-point attempts. Powell for three. And again, it's the Trailblazers from deep. Gradually starting to put pressure on this defense. That's his second from downtown this quarter. Three for the game. Ilyasova passes to Dinwiddie. Back to Ilyasova. Offensive rebound. And it's put back up and in by Rondo. Rondo's got the game tied up here for Montreal. Rondo is a clever player. 
recognizing how to track down second chance opportunities. The pass to Cantor. Well timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. He's got eight. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Rondo's shot is good. Really admire the fact that Rondo is not afraid to go down there in the paint from time to time. Now, here's Lillard. He's got five. Pass to Canner. The putback. And Cantor able to finish. And the Trailblazers lead by two. And since the first quarter, we've seen them ease off on that long-range affair. And frankly, that's probably a good idea. The veteran presence of Danny Green keeping his eyes up, finding his teammate wide open. That's a two from Lillard. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Nine seconds left in the first half. Here's Dinwiddie. No good on the triple. And some good action through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Trailblazers out in front. They're up by... And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back. Taking a look at the Trailblazers, they've hung tough in what was a closely contested first half. That's all for now. Say good... What an atmosphere in here as we return to the action of the Western Conference Finals. We've got Ilya Silva, also Brooke Lopez out there, and it's Dinwiddie in at point guard. A reverse. Here's Poole. On the three off target. And it's Willard with the ball. He brings it up for the Portland Trail Blazers. The lead is two. And for Portland, bearing up in the backcourt, Lillard and McCullough. Ennis Cantor is out there with Rondé Hollis-Jefferson. And it's Powell in at the small four. Took him no time at all on that one. Dinwiddie's got 18 points. Adding to this lead, he's been dependable and consistent at the offensive end. From D, Billy Asova. And another three for Montreal. He got a clean look, and he makes the defense pay for disrespecting him. There's Hollis Jefferson, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. That's on Brooke Lopez. And really, the defense fouling there to prevent the layup, but that's exactly what you need to do. The Trailblazers shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. And the first one drops. So for Montreal, Brooks comes in for Danny Green. And it's Dennis Smith in for Dinwiddie. And Portland with a change here, too. Collins is checked in. Here's Poole. Misses the three. And it's the Trailblazers with the ball. Lillard outside. It's hauled in by Ilias Hover. Lillard's gone one of four from distance. For three, Smith gets it to go from beyond the arc. And Montreal leads by five. The defense a step slow, and you can see the result. Inside, Lillard. Terrific assist, a nice finish. Solid play all around. No excuse giving Lillard that kind of positioning. That's just too easy. Poole the pass to Lopez. From the arc. And another three for Montreal. All these threes they're giving up have really been the driving force on this run. Trailblazers trail by six to the inside. Powell, that's good. He's got 11. Offensively, McCollum sees the floor well. Not surprised to see him spot the open teammate. Montreal calls timeout. So both teams changing it up here. And we're just about two minutes into the second half now. Smith with it. He's picked up by Collins. Brissett passes to Brooks. Hits it from three-point range. Brooks has got the lead up to seven now for Montreal. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. 
McCollum against Jackson. Nobody near Lillard. And he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. And that's 11 points for Lillard. And part of what makes Dame special, he can pour it in working off the ball. Rare to see a point guard who finds points without the rock in their hands. No coverage that time. And now just a two-point Montreal lead. Lopez finds Brooks over Little. A new 14 for Montreal. A three ball. And Brooks is good for three. Brooks has got six in the quarter. Their ability, again, to stretch the floor, particularly in this second half. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. Looks smart when the shots are going down. And he's clearly led the way offensively. The question is, can they ride him and get back into it? Makes it off the glass. Smith's got his second bucket of the night. A, a physical player. Even when you hit Smith Jr., he doesn't blink. Wills those shots in. McCollum outside. Now here's Little. Brooks covering. Little gets the bucket. And so far in the second half, this has been a different kind of game than what we saw early on. And in this half, a more entertaining one. The pace is picked up. Tougher defense. Better ball movement. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Smith against Lillard. 12 seconds left in the third quarter. Six on the shot clock. 17-foot shot on the way. And off the left side of the rim, and it swirls in for him. And how about Lillard just being aggressive here on offense? He can heat up quickly, just super efficient, and a high IQ score. And the game still closely contested as we end the third quarter. How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? And how about the big fella here showing us he's got some point guard skill here with the tremendous setup. Let me tell you, when you can run offense through your bigs, you give the defense just another thing it has to try and take away. And with these teams locked in a very close contest, this fourth quarter promises to be a good one. We've got Green. Elias Oda out there with Brooke Lopez. That's Rajon Rondo. And it's Dinwiddie in at the shooting guard. I'm glad we got to see the mobile one block once more. What a play. And it's a different kind of defense teams play in the postseason. More in your face, physical, high energy plays like that one. And you know they wanted that one to go down. They could have tied it up. That was a huge opportunity they missed. That's their third straight make off an assist. Trailblazers trail by four. Powell, the pass to Cannon. The dish to Lillard. Pass to Simons. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. He's off on the first. And Montreal making a change here. Pools checked in. And he sinks the second. Montreal leading by three. Fires from deep. Here's Lopez. Passes it to Poole. Drills the three-pointer. If you came to watch a scoring battle, you're in the right place. Yeah, both teams trying to close out strong. These are the fireworks that fans came to see. Portland moving the ball around. Lillard with it. He's picked up by Rondo. There's the pass to Simon. Missing that one helps out all the analytical guys from the mid-range. Got that one up quick. And it's a nine-point Montreal lead. I don't think the defense had any idea what they were doing there. Clear miscommunication leading to an easy basket for the offense. Yes, that goes in. Lillard's got 21. Almost unstoppable on the drive. Lillard's talent for ball handling letting him just cut through the defense. From deep green... Back to Rondo. Here's Poole. A chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. Trailblazers trail by seven. Here's Simons. And another three for Portland. 
Confident and composed on the three-point shot at a critical juncture. Montreal calls timeout. A.J. McCollum, he's checked in for the Trailblazers. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin, Montreal's head coach talked to his team during that timeout. He's happy with how they've been playing. He told them, hey, they had their chance, but this is where we take it from them. This is our game and our series. He's got them pretty fired up, Kevin. And we're around two minutes into the fourth quarter here. Count it. How about the fearlessness of McCollum? Doesn't shy away from taking or making the big shots. Green inside the three-point line and right on target. Good. And Montreal leads by four. See, that's money. Important point in this game. Danny Green takes it upon himself. It's McCollum with the drive. Foul for three. And the rebound goes to Rajon Rondo. Montreal leading by four. On deep. Can't hit that one. And the Trailblazers going the other way. And it's McCollum in the corner. And the three ball is good. McCollum's got five points now this quarter. And you can't give McCollum any space. Always a threat to pull the trigger. From deep green. That's in. That's his fifth field goal. He's shooting a hot 71%. Five for seven. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. They're behind by four. 111 left to play here in the fourth. And now let's present our new balanced player of the game. And his touch from long range has been money. Yeah, he's totaled four three-pointers on a very efficient night of shooting. And that's what turned a good game for him into a great one. Dinwiddie's checked in for Montreal. Down low. Kicks it out to McCollum. Cuts it fly. That one off the back iron and out. And here's Montreal. Cool. The rebound by Simon. Not sure if that's the shot you were looking for, but it's a fairly clean look. Almost have to take it. That is world class. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. The thing is, you want to do everything you can to help your team, and sometimes you just try to do too much. Cantor. Got it! A huge shot to tie it up! And his teammates love it. Cantor taking charge on a huge possession. You can just see him brimming with confidence, not afraid of the big moment. Leases one from three. Well, what I want to know, where is the communication defensively? It's been that way all night. Each team just trying to outscore the other. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. They trail by three. There's 25 seconds left in the fourth. And the Trailblazers making a change here. Lillard's checked in. A three. But they get it back. Here's Powell, and it's blocked, and he keeps control of the ball. Good. They're in total command of this game with time starting to run out. Reason why they've tightened up the vice grip a little more each time up the floor. We'll see if they can close this one out. This is what he's known for. When it's an important possession, Lillard knows how to come through. So we see Montreal get the win here. A pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You know, Kevin, momentum so, so critical. And you know...